Hi. I, my name's Howard Lansberger, and I had a lot of friends who asked me how I did this painting. How I was able to create the Northern Lights. So I told them I would make a video on how I did it. So let's get started, and we'll see how it's done. What I did is I took a white canvas, painted it with black gesso, then I coated it with a very thin, thin coat of liquid clear oil paint by Bob Ross. Then I wiped it off with a paper towel just so there was a little bit left, just enough to pick up on my fingertips. After that, I put on some transparent color. Can't see them right now because they're transparent color. Some Elizabeth Crimson here, Indian Yellow, Phthalo black, blue, phthalo green, phthalo blue, and then I just kind of went across. So let's get started and let's make some northern lights. The easiest way to do this is take a fan brush, number three will work, and start laying out where you want your light arcs. So let's put one right. Come up a little bit, right about there, put in another one, right about there, come over here, put in another arc, right there, come over here, and let's put one in right like that. Now you can't see them because I didn't have any color on the brush. I'm going to get some titanium white next. Okay, we're going to take a number three fan brush, pick up some titanium white. Now you want this to be a very firm, firm white paint. A uh, good way to test it is squeeze it out of the tube. If it sticks up by about three quarters of an inch, then it's firm enough. Now where we made those arc lines, you want to take your fan brush and just tap, 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 right around where you left those arc lights. Just bring this right on around, just like so. Load up with some more, and you're going to do this for all of your arc lights. You have one right there, Bring this right on around and have it meet like, like that. Get some more. Grab it, pull it straight up. Pull it straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Just want to blend it straight on up just like so. And then on the top, straight up, straight up, straight up. And we're going to continue to try to keep this top pretty even. And you want to keep your line straight. Right over to where it turns, just like so. As you see, that transparent color is starting to come out to create that illusion of the northern lights. Let's do this one. Straight up. And I'm just going to do all of these real quick.
Okay. Now take a clean, dry, one inch brush. And blend it up. Straight up. I'm not too worried about this bottom because we're going to have mountains and some scenery in there. But just like so. Because this is a slick canvas, the paint will move for you. And that's what makes this work. Straight up, straight up, straight up. Okay. Now, take a clean, dry, two-inch brush, and very lightly. Two hairs and some hair. Two hairs and some hair just go over the whole thing to remove your left hooks. Just like so. And that's how you create the illusion of your Borealis. Next, we're going to do the background mountains and some middle ground trees and start with the snow.